Decomposition is the ability to break down a task or complex problem into minute details so that we can clearly explain a process to another person, to a computer, or for our own benefit. If a problem is too big or too complicated, we usually subdivide it until it's a series of smaller, more manageable tasks or problems. We solve each individually and hope that in combination, the sub-solutions can provide the whole solution. Many problems that computer scientists are faced with are complex and can be broken down into smaller tasks. This is the same for creating digital solutions. To create software or digital technology, we need to explore the components of the problem or the task and then how we can address each to create an entire solution. A decomposition process might look something like this. Firstly, we identify the main problem. We list main components, functions or tasks. We list subcomponents for each. And then we devise a plan or process to address each task. This is our algorithm. Then we complete each subcomponent. Let's apply this process to see if we can break down a problem. Let's say I want to create a new garden in my backyard, but I'm a novice gardener. What I might do is I might break down this problem into a series of more manageable tasks to follow. I'll look at the space that I have available, what I'd like to plant, the conditions that I have, the equipment that I need, and planting and care. What I've done is I've developed a series of questions and processes to follow, as well as some things that I might need to research. What I've done is I've organised these into subcomponents, into a sequence that would hopefully end with me having a garden. Some other everyday examples where we might apply decomposition include how to make a meal, how to drive to your house, how to play a game, how to plan a dinner party, or even planning a presentation or a lesson. Can you think of any other problems or situations? Decomposing a problem frequently leads us to pattern recognition and generalization, and assists us with the ability to design an algorithm. Computer scientists use decomposition to ensure that they address all aspects of the problem, to ensure that they're explicit in their instructions to the computer, as a framework for cost and time estimation, and as a means to identify what needs to be done, when, how, and by whom. Decomposition is an important technique that we'll use in combination with abstraction to develop algorithms. We will be exploring how this is done in our algorithms unit.